Uh, it's called the Boppet Hedgehog. Everyone knows that. Okay. I just felt like doing a very simple review. And people might not say this is a Boppet, but I kind of counted it as one. So the heads up was made in 2000. The year that the Super Click It was made. Yay! And um, actually, a lot of games were made that year, which is kind of strange. So it's got five objects. A nose, a hat, two ears on left and right, and a mouth. And and the oh, and it's got some eyes. And um, the hat, the two ears, and the mouth pop up. Well, not up, but in the direction they're facing. And then he's got to pop them back in. The nose, however, twists, and then you got to twist it back in its position. And the eyes just don't do anything, they're just there for decoration. So, flipping it over to the back first. There's a switch. Well, it comes with a handle, which is removable. Or at least mine did. One of mine did. The working one, which is the one I have here, came with a handle. And you just attach it to uh, the two rectangle holes on each of the sides where the ears are. I guess you could say a tiny bit above them, but not exactly. And then the battery goes on your left. And then this, there's a switch on your right. And then down at the... Uh, no, I forgot to say, there's a speaker below the battery door. And then there's a switch on the right. And then down at the kind of like bottom left, there's a button. So I'll explain what these do. Uh, so if you hold it the normal way, and the face is facing you all the way to the left is off into the middle is solo and to the right is passive now before we get started you have to uh before you start the game you have to push all the pieces in so if one's sticking out then all the rest are going to pop out you'll pop all five in and it will start the game <clears throat> and it will also do a waiting sound so uh you and me okay here we go so you press the button at the bottom to start, but since the uh, nose is twisted, when I push the button, it's gonna make an error noise, and then all the rest are gonna pop out. And if I don't push all five, you know, well, you'll just it's gonna be a waiting noise. So pushing four. That's the waiting noise, and because I've got one left, so I can push in. You and me. The game will start. So that's pretty much the basics, but I will show you the solo and the passive. So as the game gets faster in music, it adds two popping out at once, and then three, and then four. The high score is 199, it's pretty easy, and I'm surprised they didn't do all five for the 200th phrase, which I think they should. And then on past it, it just says next player, and so I kind of found it exactly like it, and play some music, so. It operates on four AA batteries, that's pretty awesome, and uh, I'll just play a little bit of solo. You and me. Okay. Now when I go to pass it, since the nose is twisted, it's going to do the air noise again. Uh, you know what happens if you lose on solo? You, and me. you can't, if you don't push it in, you only get one point. 
And you can push it in when you hit the button and it does the air noise. You and me. And then there's you and me. It will say all of us or you and me until you uh, hit the button, but apparently sometimes it doesn't use switch. I'll show you when it does two at once. You and me. Because I don't want this review to be huge, you know. Okay, so that's pretty much the basics of this thing. It's very short. Uh, it's very easy. Um, buy yourself a heads up. They're mainly cheap on eBay. But get a new one, please. Because the used ones, they're not going to be so good.